Hey guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. It's so close, thanks for supporting me, guys. Malik Scott, the trainer of former World Heavyweight Champion Dante Wilder, he is convinced that the American boxer will need only three rounds to knock out Anthony Joshua. Nothing can be said for sure in the heavyweight division. But at the moment, the fight with Andy Ruiz is scheduled for the WBC Eliminator. Let's see what happens. A lot of cool things happen in boxing, but whether it's Ruiz, Joshua or someone else against a disciplined Dante, none of them will last more than three rounds. A duel with Joshua. This is a three-round fight. AJ won't be able to resist Dante Wilder for a disciplined, consistent Wilder. This is a three-round duel. Scott said. Malik Scott, a trainer of former World Heavyweight Champion Dante Wilder, believes that the undefeated Briton Joe Joyce should fight his word as soon as possible before he loses the ability to hold the punch. I believe that if the Joe Joyce fights Wilder, it should happen soon. If he continues to participate in good, exciting fights, then his chin at stubbornness will wear out. And when he gets to Wilder, then in general he will be a lukewarm. That's what I think about the number of missed shots. I just believe that the Joe has an expiration date. It's cool and nice for the fans when they say, this guy is tough, he has a strong jaw, but it goes away. Think of any fighter whose chin you thought was great. Over time, it even ceases to be your favorite attribute, because the holder goes away. We're not made to take blows. Joyce may take good shots, respond immediately and save probably the best poker face I've ever seen, but I believe there are time limits here. And that moment may come when he fights Wilder. We will see how it goes, Scott said. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks for supporting me, guys. As we previously reported in a recent interview, Dmitry Salita, the promoter of the Swedish heavyweight Otto Wallin, reacted to the rumor that the former real heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua of Britain will hold the next fight against the Australian Dempsey Makin. According to Salita, Anthony should take an example from the American Dante Wilder, who returned to the ring after two defeats, meeting with a strong opponent, namely Finn Robert Hellenius. After Wilder lost to Fury, he fought with an authoritative globally recognized, legitimate heavyweight from the top 10. Now he is ready to fight with the best heavyweight, based on the progress with his coach Malik Scott. I really respect the work that Malik has done with Dante. Wilder regained his confidence after his tough defeat by defeating a strong fighter, Salita said. Based on the above, the promoter believed that Otto Wallin will be an ideal candidate to rival Anthony Joshua. According to Dmitry, his word is ready to meet with AJ on April 1st in London. Otto Wallin wants and is ready to come to the United Kingdom on April 1st to fight Joshua. It will be a great fight, the promoter said. Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video please subscribe to my YouTube channel.